And there we go. Watch Underwater by Leando in four. And watch Karoon in five. As a Canadian record holder in the 200-meter butterfly, he has a, an amazing second 50. So we'll see if Leando works to get himself out a little bit further than he did this morning. He was out in 23.9 on that first 50. Here we go at the 50 wall. Leando, look at this, 23.6. Three tenths of a second better than he was this morning. Underwater is fantastic, right out to 14 and a half meters. Karun is second in lane number five, a 24-1, followed by Knox in three. Watch the record, 50.78. Canadian record, world number one so far this year. And Leando is looking fantastic and not slowing down as he comes to the finish. Josh Leando, 50.36, four tenths of a second faster than he did this morning. Nailed that finish and saw the time drop four tenths of a second off that Canadian record. That is a fantastic swim by Leando. Second goes to Karun. New lifetime best time by a full tenth of a second for him, 51.45. Third and bronze goes to Finley Knox in lane number th three, a time of 52.11. And worth noting, Ilya is under that FINA A standard, so he may have just put himself on his first world championship team. We're seeing now, the results are official, new Canadian record for Josh Leander, 100 fly. That was a coach's dream. The last about seven, eight meters, he had his head down, did not take a single breath. When I talk about things you can change from the morning swim, that was a perfect example of fine-tuning those details and putting together an incredible performance. Uh, great swim by Josh Lando. Working on some of the little, little technical pieces that we saw, and no doubt his coach had a conversation with him about. He did it here tonight. Nailed that finish and took off nearly a half second from his Canadian record mark that he set this morning. Here we go with your race winner, Leando, and Brittany McLean. Josh Leando, the newest Canadian record holder, 50.36 in the men's 100 meter butterfly. What does it feel to hear your name beside that time? I mean, it feels great. I've not been working really hard. Just came from a meet, and you know, to sit, come here and show up. It's awesome. It feels good. And how do you transition that incredible NCAA performance, similar to the turnaround Meg had, but you had even less time, going from a short course yards pool to here in long course? Did you feel it on that final stretch, or were you kind of just as sharp as ever? I mean, I, I was starting on the final stretch, but I mean, even after the yards, I knew I was, was going to be good long course. Like, I was just ready to come. This is my favorite event long course, so I mean, it wasn't anything I thought I couldn't handle. Amazing, and you absolutely handled it. The world number one time, Josh Leando, your new national champion. Leando, great, great swim.